Welcome. Thank you for serving the nation. Hello, folks. This is Clisto8413. Let me make sure my mic is working and not brushing against anything. There you go. Uh, we're going to start Chapter 3 of Orwell. As you know, last time I accidentally went and instead of exiting the game, I started third day number three. And so Smeeze was able, or Smy was able to get a few words in before I could stop him and exit. The funny thing is, exiting Orwell and exiting Orwell the game are two different things. And so it says day three, but I'm not actually done day three yet. I just started like a few seconds. Thank you for ensuring the safety of the nation's people. First Nation? My, are we Native American? Uh, never mind. That was a horrible pun. I'll leave now. Oh, wait. I have to start the game. Never mind. I'll, I'll play with the game. Make sure my mic is actually not on mute. There I go. I hate to say all those jokes and not have anybody laugh at them. Mm. Okay. Uh, before... We start, new objective. Gather additional information on Nina, who I have no idea who it is. Weather warning, your safety is at stake when your neighbor's walls is ablaze. Oh, is that the rationale for going into other nations and trying to clear up their shit? Yeah, yeah, okay. Now we want to find out more about guys just, just floating around so much. Where's Nina? There she is. But we are you sure that's your name? Despises law enforcement. Okay. Let's go through headlines first. Cast a root. What happened to the photos? Oh, it's like my internet connection. All right. Yeah, nothing was here. Is this Hancock's uh, newspaper thing? Yeah. We don't know. Uh... So yeah. Okay. So now he said, "Well, let's get something clear." I feel bad. I feel like a effing moron. Rightly so. Last week's. An O article I babbled about blathered, blathered. Okay, about how much how some bombs would go off and blah blah blah. Just five my point of view. I'm truly sorry for everyone involved. Never my attention to real kill or yeah. Okay. We the people of Great New should grow more. Found ourselves much. Yeah, I don't think um, safety wants a high tech security man. Okay, well, I, I agree with that. Uh, high safety, you know, cameras and all that only works if other people are also adding to it. They're part of our perception, not taking over. So I don't think he's saying anything he doesn't agree with. He's just saying it in a way that he's not committing to anything. Yeah. And this... It was never my intention to real care to jeopardize the attacks. Once again, he's not saying anything. Yeah. Before anything happened, but. Well, you know, people predict things. You know, uh. What was that pilot that spin off from X Files, the, uh. The Lone Gunman? About those guys who believed the uh, Lone Gunman theory and the uh, pilot episode? had uh, a plane being controlled by the government almost hit the World Trade Center in uh, in New York. And then everybody afterwards is telling them, oh, you predicted it all, I predicted it all. And they're like, no, we didn't predict anything. Don't, don't look at us, you know. Okay. So, oh, his email. Hey. All right. And so I have to do this the old-fashioned way. I really wanted to thank you for the nice evening. Enjoy myself as much, uh, only to be topped by that night. That is a. Oh, this is a girl. Okay. Funny, I've just realized I've never been to your place, even after all these years we have unknown. 
We have known each other, so I figure you're hiding another love affair of yours there. Are you? Probably your ex, the one you've been talking about ever since. I was mean, around, or that girl's, always, or this girl that's always jamming about how she despised the safety bill. Okay. But wait a minute. X versus a girl who's always yammering about how she despised the safety bill. That means... That doesn't mean she's in a relationship with him. That just means she doesn't like the safety bill. Which... Considering she hates law enforcement. Why would somebody oppose the safety bill? We have the lowest climb rate in years, or possibly ever. You know I mean? We have a job thanks to that, to that bill. To the bill. The reason to not support is if you have a dirty past. Or if you want to communicate with people. Oh, well. So, as he just is, it sounds like somebody will have a very close look at. Yes. We need a full ex... First, a contract background. Who is she? Second, what motives her? What motivates her? What does she want? Finally, where is she around the time of the bombings? Right. Uh, that's going to be a very long... Can I... Can I... Okay. So we got to find out who she is. War of Indifference. Uh -huh. War of Indifference. Okay. And this is her, right? Does it tell us anything? It gives us a uh, email. Thank you. So we can look at her email. That's always a good thing. Thank you. War of indifference. The indifference towards their own rights is the worst enemy than a government itself when we are to overcome privacy, destroying surveillance laws. Straight war against our own government. The declaration of war is the safety bill, the one gain of which is reinforcing the chokehold the party has on us. With this bill, they are screwing it. Oh, okay. Yet most people are ignored to this. Most people simply don't care about the rights being wrestled from them. Why should I bother to vote? And my vote won't matter anyway, even though my vote might force other people who I either voted for or voted against to think about switching or moving to the center to be a more moderate or cover my view, just like Hillary did, even though that means she alienated the left and and did nothing to actually bring the right or most of the conservative moderates into her... Oh, wait, I'm babbling. Never mind. Uh, why bother when I have nothing to hide was their default excuse. They feel safe in their cozy houses while the government slowly pulls the muzzle to their forehead ready to pull the trigger any second. No, you don't kill the citizens. That's who give you power. The citizens are the horses pulling the cart. You don't kill the citizens. You just make sure they don't see what's going around them. They get blinders. Well, whatever. With our move on the crowded Circle Mall in Botton yesterday, they should have really picked a different name, Botton. That's just, the first shots have been fired towards the lurking indifference among the populace, but they are merely warning shots, a friendly reminder of what's about time to take sides in this conflict. We cannot tolerate indifference. We will not accept blah, blah, blah. Uh, how are you putting inside the crowd? Frankly, I was shocked when I heard of the events in the mall, how you in particular excite the crowd to directly threaten the visitors. Uh -huh. You know, I agree people having been oblivious in this matter is the problem's root. We have discussed this many times. We must get their attention carefully, though, through interesting and remarkable events. We must make them think. Scaring them to death is the exact opposite. It's convincing them. Abe. People will only care about things that pose immediate threats to their life or lifestyle. Your own words. Ooh. Surveillance is too abstract a topic, too far away to gasp. They don't feel the danger, so we made them feel it's as simple as that. Why argument for a moment? What did you achieve here? When you upset innocent bystanders by blocking the roads in Washington, D.C., affecting Congress or the President in no way whatsoever, but just affecting employees of the D.C. government or the federal government and making your case in no way, since all they do is now get angry. Oh, wait, I'm, I'm, I'm going off again. 
Violence cannot be the key, and thought shall not stand for that. Violence, there's no violence. No one was hurt. Frightened at least about best. Honestly, I think it wasn't even enough. Hmm. Ladies and gents, can we calm down a notch? Abe, you're totally right. We're fucking fire starters. We got a little bit carried away, but we are finally getting our message out there. Always apologetic. Thanks for stabbing him back. Okay, well, I have a whole bunch of things here. Okay, frighten at best. You wanted to scare people. One message, really? That's what the thought is about? Well, no, I don't think so. Because he... He says otherwise. Let's go to his. And make sure... All right. Violence cannot be the key, and thought shall not stand for that. In fact, he doesn't like that either. Though I'm beginning to think he just says whatever people like to hear. He's an author. You know what they say about science fiction authors? Learn to lie. People love lies. That's what science fiction is about. That's what fiction is about. You're lying. Ha. Huh. Afterwards, they're clear and feel sorry about their actions. It's always the same. Well, no. She obviously doesn't feel sorry. He doesn't want to be part of it. Or he wants to be part of it as long as it gets some chicks. At least that's the kind of the message I'm getting. Kind of. And my part tonight, but let's not stay at my part place tonight. So he doesn't... I'm assuming because he lives in a trailer place. Okay, especially not Julia. I haven't heard of much, uh, uh, so he's not. So he's not with her anymore. None of you mean anything will set me off. Angry outburst. Boop. Joe Harrison, we're together. It's one's news for me. I guess it doesn't matter. It seems to be over now. Yes, yes. Anything will set me off. Um. What am I? What am I touching? Okay, this is what I want. Now, is that true? I mean, she seems angry. She's obviously pissed off. Anything, but anything will set me off. Angry outburst sounds more like something like, "Hey, babe, no, I, I never loved her. She was a psychopath." Smart in crime a while ago too. That sounds a little weird. I don't like the the. See, this is is this real information? or Is this a boyfriend trying to tell another? A girlfriend that his ex-girlfriend was crazy and you know that's why yeah I'm breaking that off now she was my partner in crime a while ago the problem is I don't picture him as doing anything criminal he's an idiot might be the picture affecting me but still I, uh, still I, uh, I'll put that one in Yeah, partners in crime? Okay, what crime? Yeah, I knew you'd say that. The problem is, I don't picture him being capable of doing anything. Oh, uh, well, okay. Wanted to ask if everything is fine. We have, we're having a great time. Thanks for taking care of those who don't mention it. How are you feeling? Still shitty. Oh, I guess this is going to be a highlighted moment, isn't it? Uh, you always look so sad. Oh, no. Wait, is that actually useful? Well, I'm putting it in there anyway. I mean, she has to be sad or depressed to be a terrorist, obviously. Be ready to find out what it's about. Yes, well, obviously, that's why I gave it to you. Singular portal thing you recommended. What? I, I don't know what that is. I'm giving it to you, but I don't know what that is. Well, fine, good, you found something, but I still don't know what it is. Only idiots on the singular... Oh! 
Is it Facebook? No, that's Timeline. Uh, I don't know how you got to find John. Oh, it's a dating site. Well, those are crap. Yes. Well, no. Well, I'm not saying anything on this uh, YouTube, but yeah. It, sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. <laughs> okay, it's 90% fools. Well, it depends on the website. <clears throat> anyway, you really have to kind of focus on what you want. Um... Yeah, I turned parts of that off. So let's see, what has he found for me? Oh, it's a singular. Don't be single, be singular. That that really sounds stupid. Hey, hello, concerned one. Great to see you again. It's a good day to fall in love. This is a public profile. Everything you enter here is visible for any visitor. Thank you. I know she's female. But I'm not sure I need to uh, put the fact in that she's heterosexual. Though, 1985, she's looking for older women. I mean, older men. <laughs> I'd be looking for older women, but. Or younger women, or any women, you know, because I'm not. Ageist or racist? Come on, the mouse thing's doing it again to me. Okay, athletic. Uh, do I really need the likes? Uh, okay, well. Occupation. No, what I want is occupation. Who's that? Who's that? Recent visits. Who's who's these? Nobody? Nobody? You're not gonna tell me anything? Just like suit wear as well. In other words, you, you don't like suits. In other words, you're not into bureaucrats. Huh. What's your problem with suits, huh? But I do like hiking, climbing. She's active. I don't think that it, I don't think this part matters at all. So I'm gonna. Yes, she's a heterosexual. Don't care. I don't think that has anything to do with anything. Okay, your opinions. Okay, this will help us fill out a little more about her personality. True love, flexible stability. Well, that's always that's like 100% of the women, probably, isn't it? I mean. What do you want, potential partner? Who doesn't? Yeah, that does not really. She. I pushed that too fast. Sorry, guys. You probably could see it. How long do you wish your next couple of years? Forever? I'm looking for a short term relationship. Yeah. Might as well just replace this with sex. Serve allow your partner seeing other people. Sir, dating someone who does not want to. Is it like children? No. What place would you like to go on vacation? How much politics are you? Quite a bit. Well, obviously. Comes down to what degree of interest and what agenda. Yes. What? Are you a cat or dog? Dog person! Oh, no, I can't. You're, you're obviously a scum terrorist. Yes. I bet you're a vegetarian, too, yes. What is, uh, if you turn left-handed glove inside out, it fits, well, it would, well, if you turn the left-handed glove inside out, it, technically, I guess it would fit your right hand, but I'm not sure what that question's about. Anyway, depends on the glove. Yeah. A mitten, yeah, but that's not glove. Never mind. Okay, conversations. Hi, I just saw your profile. You seem quite nice. Sir. Do you have any more pictures? Or let me. Oh, okay, that's a little disgusting. Yay! Hey, Blondie, just came across your uh, your striking beauty, uh, Blondie. I'm an '80s. Me too. Uh, now I'm totally get why you're. Over thirty and still single, or bitch. Wow, you're. Why, Sam? 
Samwise the Strong. Hey, this guy must be a Hobbit fan. Oh, he wrote her a, a, a wall of text. Hey, concerned one, I just read your interesting profile. It left me dying for more information. Now, here I am asking away like you requested. If you dislike candlelight dinners, I suppose that meant candlelit dinners? Yeah. And movies, as you stated, guys will probably have a hard time dating you. Not really. I mean, there's always, like, think, you know, TGIF or... There's a lot of family restaurants that don't have candlelight. I mean, uh, that makes me wonder, what is it you would like to do on a potential first date? Of course, I would resolve to just ask you out to the local Chinese place around the corner and just abandon the all the candle part of the dinner. And still, that does seem a bit straightforward. Um, well, I think the only thing you have to worry about on a first date is making sure she doesn't die from food poisoning or allergies. You know, pretty much that's... Yeah. I mean, my standards probably are low, but, you know, on a first date... You don't want to get hyperactive about where to eat as much as giving her a good impression, showing that you're interested, asking her questions, not just doing the whole, ask me anything, I want to get to know you. No, you ask her the questions. Um, and you listen to what she has to say without prompting her. I could really use a helping hand here. Care to lend me yours? Oh, ho, ho. good letter, though. I do like it. And I do like why Sam, because when I think that, I think Samwise the Strong, and I think of Hobbit, but, yeah. Names, oh, I got a name, 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 name. Hi, Sam, it's kind of refreshing to read a decent message from, yes, yes, Molly, yes, she's using a fake name. It's a particular one at that. How do you know it's a fake name? Oh, it's a website, a dating site, of course. The okay, whatever. Um... But he's using Wise Sam, which makes me think of Hobbit, so maybe she's gotten her name from something else, though I don't... Molly? Yeah. Hi, my Oh, great. Suits me well, because, no kidding here, I don't like this stuff either. I think most guys don't, though it is nice from time to time, especially with the right woman. Speaking of which, let's hope I can tell me a little more, a little bit more about yourself, what a pers what the person behind this small picture and all the these separate chunks of data is like. Data chunks, hey! What does Molly do for a living? What does she do when she's at home? Does she live all alone? Or is there somebody waiting for her? Does she often get to climb? Oh, because she's climbing. Oh, for a second there, I thought he was being a pervert. Oh, sorry. Never mind. <clears throat> because I probably am more of a pervert than he is, but whatever. Please, Molly, feed a full craving for each bit of knowledge about you. Don't, leave me, don't let me starve. Hey, same... Sam, you're quite the dramatic guy, aren't you? Anyway, here I go. I work wherever I find, a.k.a. tip work. Hope you weren't looking for somebody who is a shiny job type. I live in a small flat in between tons of industrial waste. You still with me? And indeed, I don't live alone. There's a special somebody in my life. My son, Michael. <gasps> hmm. And a temp work. Yes. Hmm. Type to be evolved. Doesn't seem like type of terrorist attacks. That's usually why they're, it's hard to find them. You moron. <sighs> Temp work. So I probably... What did that open up? That opened up something. Work easy. It's a temp position. And we have... A pitcher. I don't know. She's using a fake name. So that's not really her, is it? But neither one of these is actually her, because she used a fake name on a date. So then neither of these pictures are actually the real her. <sighs> okay, cleaning. So she's done... She's done a little bit of everything. Customer service, which means she has to be good with people. Groundskeeping which means she has to be good with certain utilities, and not utilities, tools, and knowing the difference between a weed and a, a flower, and cleaning, which means she does deal with chemicals, and maintenance, mechanical repair, which means she's air conditioning, so I mean, wow. <sighs> the 
Weekend? It's different, of course, when you're a single mother. This must be tough. Yes. Oh, oh, wait. Okay. Well, I got email. That's got to work because they want to be able to send her stuff. But this says the address might be in conflict with her, so this might be a fake address. It is a fake name. So I'm going to assume it's a f that might be a fake address. No, it's... I didn't read the whole website, did I? Um, okay, let's go back. Looking for a job, looking for a temporary staff. In both cases, you come to the right place. With WorkEasy, you have the nation's largest database of more than 47,000 reliable temp and part-time workers and over 5,600 high-profile employers right at your fingertips. That's actually not for a national largest database for the nation's largest database that's actually not a lot of people or a lot of businesses for that. for convenience and safety we offer escrow payments third person payments kind of okay connecting temporary employees with employers of many repair and maintenance administrative retail service okay well something's opened up examination results Dear Miss... Whoa! Just as the Prime Minister leaves, the weather is getting shittier. Thank you. I, I, I needed that right when I was doing something more important. I've got a name. And this is the doctor. What address did he use? What what address did he use? Wait, where 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 where? Dang, it doesn't it doesn't show what email address he used. Because if he's using the other address, he would have been confused. Okay, uh, I'm writing on behalf of Doctor White on your last visit. On your last visit at our office, a blood sample was taken. This was then sent to the Baton Central. Hospital's laboratory for examination. You'll be, of course, be forced to pay for that because your insurance doesn't cover that. Oh, I, 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 I would like to inform you the results is now in. Dated of, date of report, April 13th. Oh, today. Uh, 2017. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. It's, it's a month ago. Patient number. Oh, I got a patient number. That would give me correct information, right? She's not going to lie to her doctor about stuff. I might get an actual address. Okay, well, this is bound to be her real name. Can I, can I touch that? Thank you. Yeah, I think this is my mouse, because I'm pretty sure this... My mouse blinks. It doesn't blink to you. You probably see a solid mouse, but my mouse is blinking. Now, and that... Yeah, they even got Nate and Anya, so... So that's probably in patient's name. Probably gave me um, nothing more here. A doctor's office, right? Uh, please, 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 please. Yes, doctor's office. Headlines. Blaine cancels meeting surprise visit to Turfia, which looks vaguely Soviet German. Yes, I know he did. Yay. Now let's go back. Oh, there's Singular. Oh, so some of these ads actually. Uh, right. Rosen? Yeah, okay. Uh, profile. Uh, oh, still stuff there? Oh, you have the address. Well, yeah, I know. Um, but I'm hoping the doctor will have. Yeah, okay. First of all, birth date. Come here. Now, of course, the patient's name is that. Oh, God. Uh, they'll wait. I'm assuming she won't lie to her doctor. I'm assuming she won't lie to her doctor as much as she'd lie to a dating site, which might get hacked and give her address away to some pervert. Or, no, wait, wait. It wasn't, it wasn't the dating site. It was the temporary work site, right? If she's going to lie, she's not going to lie to the doctor. 
She doesn't have insurance. She's a temp worker. Of course she doesn't have insurance. Yes, I know that. Patient complains about pain throughout the left thigh and upper leg. She describes the pain as searing, burning, sometimes bursting. The leg feels numb at times. Symptoms occur whenever the leg is stressed, releasing only when sitting or lying down. I have asked the patient regarding the healed wound on her left upper leg as no medical record exists in this. She's, oh. So she was wounded. Feels, hmm. Deep wound. Due to a, uh, okay, so a weapon. <laughs> Prior inflicted wound on dorsal left upper leg. Medical leave with stricter. St Wait, this is in conflict with somebody else. I don't even know what it's conflict with though. Okay, but she's obviously been wounded, and there's no. Uh, so, oh, the info may come in handy though. Yes, I know that. Go to previous entry. Oh. Uh, payment reports of digestive nausea and vomiting come by light fever. Slight intention of guessing. Uh, how many times has she been in the doctor's place? June, that was like uh, June 2015. Patient reports permanent unrest, ability to sleep properly, gets up 5 to 12 times a day, does not feel overly tired. And when asked for duration, Simpsons record. Social occupation. Tends to act aggressively when feeling challenged or confronted. Rushes to extremes. Post-traumatic. She was in the military or was in a horrible situation that's caused. Yeah, well, don't sound too medicine, please. But it does suggest... Something really, really, really... Did I get everything? Okay. Yeah, well, I can't do that until I figure out if that is good. And that's only... Medical leave with strict rest until the end of April 2017 has been suggested. But does that mean she followed it? That's the conflict, probably. Yeah, headlines. Where I got the headlines? What was I listening for? Oh, there I go. Juliet, an unknown person. Oops. Come on, give me that. Thank you. It's an alias, either way. All right. Uh, uh, nickname is that? It's obviously his sister's nickname, you idiot. <laughs> About time. I was working today. No, no, hanging around the office just a groom. It's not. Being alone at the time. Mom, Dad, they're so happy I'm back. I, you know, disappointed with you. Here I was thinking Juliet had finally reached a state of. Occupation. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, haven't you letting yourself be harassed by mom and dad yet again? Hmm. Hmm.
just clear that up I want to see the date so this is June her big sister and this means this is probably a lot of information that doesn't really have anything to do with anybody I don't see why I need to make a new profile, but annual chat sounds like she doesn't deal with her family very much. Nothing to say, Smeeze or Smize or whatever your name is? All right. I want to say Sims, but it has an E there, so it's not Seems or Smeeze or whatever. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, this wasn't really the best year if you're an American citizen, but you're not American, so I don't see why you're complaining. Should you enter a relationship in that time? Yeah. Oh, so you've connected the dots there, have you? All right, well. There's still something in here? Oh, well, yeah, but that's... We've already picked that up. Mom and Dad, yeah. yeah. Is that really an issue? I don't know. Yeah, I don't see that being a problem. Now, I'm kind of stuck, though. Um... I'm kind of running out of stuff to go on. Um, well, that's available. Well, yeah, I've already seen that. Um, well, what's there's still something here, huh? There's still something I've I've not I've missed out on. Huh. See recent jobs employee feedback. Oh. Uh, April thirteenth. April twelfth. April eleventh. Wasn't she supposed to, the doctor told her to, the doctor told her uh, to stay off her feet, but she went, this says that they, they that she was working. That didn't sound good. Oh, sorry, wrong. <laughs> Rug profile, where are you? There you are. Mm -hmm. So she was working a lot over the week. Does that account for or perhaps her ability to have triggered the bombing? Depends on where. What? 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 Okay. Inchi Who the heck is that? Initiate. Oh, he's the guy who's bothering Hancock. Got to ask who's there. For knock knock jokes. Ah, oh, you blew it. Got to grab who are you? Do I know you? What is her role in this? Yes, well, that's what. Let's. Well, if you would let me get uh, do the. Yeah. Could you? Can you get off? Off. Stop it. Here we go. Feel free to investigate this actor as well, but keep a focus on. Yeah. Okay. Shop. Get out of the way, so I can actually. No. I don't care. Knows you better than you know yourself. Oh God. Care. Oh, singular. Right. No, it's not there. 
blocked. Okay, well, he doesn't like her. And he unblocked himself. Okay, that's great, wonderful. He's a stalker. He's a hacker. Who thinks he knows what's going on, which means he might have some information I don't. Or he has the same information I do, and he's not any use at all. <sighs> he might have different puzzles, pieces of the puzzle, or he might have the same pieces, and he's no more smarter than I am. Of course, I am a genius, but still. And I'm not bragging. That's actually when I was in high school, I took a uh, IQ test. Government needs to kick where the sun don't shine, so he obviously doesn't like the government. Mm -hmm. I'm going to wait till this whole conversation is over because they're going to be giving me information for both of them. And, mm -hmm. I've been watching you for all this time. Well, let me put it. A place where your outlaw posts had been in the past two weeks. No way, did not hear about that. Even the cops seemed to have found out at least something. Knew where, where to look for the last bomb. To, you know, like, put the consciousness of mine at ease. I want to help you, not turn you in. How dare you threaten me? You got nothing. You not, what the? Be cool. I said I want to help after all, not threaten you. I'll show you. I'm going to hack into the precious page of the... Oh, uh, yeah. No, you're not. Remember, some of these are time-related. I'm going to make short work of this rookie. Yeah. So... <laughs> it's going to be easy with those party it's you guys being lazy bones as long as they don't see it coming for the next few seconds. Well, some of these things are time-sensitive, like I said. So, yeah. No, you're not getting in there. Give me a second while I get to work. Don't go away. Don't switch my phone off now. If I could get away from you, I could. Can't. She turned on her phone? Can you actually shut up? <laughs> Distract myself. So how? No. Jeez. Almost done. Just a second longer. Uh, it's starting to sound more like excuses there. Did I do it fast enough? What the heck? Ha 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 ha. Oh, shit, man. They reinforced their huge gaping loophole. It just vanished. It's almost like somehow somebody warned them. Oh. Well, goodbye, initiative. It's initiative. And <laughs> wait. going to spam you for the rest of your days if you don't answer my questions. How will you fucking leave me alone and quit poking around in my life? You said you were not involved in the assaults. I'm not. Okay, okay. Do you think it's somebody else? Th Wait a minute. Band of Misfits? Never. How do I know she's telling you the truth? The only guy I can remotely imagine doing anything like that. Yeah, the one who broke up with you. Uh, you know what? No. No, I don't believe that. You could access the big money through your parents' company. Uh, that I kind of believe, actually. Okay, I'm going to wait till she's done talking. But, um... That actually makes sense. No, we're not. Good night. Uh, yeah, okay. Okay, so basically he just gave me some information about her that I want desperately. It's her computer number. Mm hmm. Button is safety. Uh, we can use the inside tour to connect and see what's. Yeah. What? Uh, what's up done? What's up done? Thank you. Yeah. Okay. Just be quiet. Well, as because of what? 
Don't worry, I'll need access to normal remotely. Fuck off, first you threat me, and now this. Wanted you all of you, you find the word. <laughs> so, um, I don't know if she's lying or not. Because we've kind of linked her to things. She's obviously violent. Saying that Harris is the only guy I remotely imagined doing anything like that. It's been suspected of possible involvement in the bombing. I don't suspect him of possible bombing. He's too wishy-washy. Interest in... Yeah, I can see... Yeah, I could see that, though. I could see he'd want her into the group because she can get them access to money. So, yeah, I could see that. But I don't see him being remotely possibly capable of doing anything related to actual involvement in bombing any more than I could be involved in a marathon. It just ain't gonna happen, people. Gosh, when your friends are, I like you for your money. Well, I don't know. Juliet's a bit of a shy... Um, but damn good at organizing stuff. Well, yeah, she organized two of them. You organized one of them. But I don't think that means that she is the bomber any more than Hancock is. Not anybody who'd sign, who'd take up the name Hancock, I don't think could be a bomber. Revolutionary, yes, but bomber, no. Um. What's here? I don't see anything here, guys. Okay. Um. So, reader. What else do we have? What else did you give me? Harrison's timeline. What did he change? He added something? Posted. Uh, I think it's must you, my little fun one. Right for the T and B. That's why you're quite out there for so long. Congratulations. Well, the hell, big revolution itself, a lackey to one of the most pro fascist, pro surveillance bullcrap newspapers. Peter, Peter, Peter. I know what you mean. I feel when the MB and. Blah, blah, blah. TMB called on to ask if I would write for them. I laughed at them hard for 30 minutes straight before laying it up. But then they called me again to let me know I could write whatever I want. No strings attached. Hell, I can even fucking swear, and I do, frankly. Now I get the attention re reach I always wanted, and I could use it for a good cause, except your writing in the newspaper is completely opposite than the writing that you put in the blog or anything else. So you're not actually reaching out with your ideas. You're reaching out with clean, delicate, government... Uh, uh, backed ideas, so could not be any funnier anyway. I know it's all been deleted. There's nothing new here. Uh, yeah. There's there's nothing new here, guys. What what were you trying to tell me was new? Is there anything else? Whoop. Permanent unrest, ability to sleep property. Oh, did I forget to... Was that even highlighted before? Um... Uh, close to Vince Pinto is not the same. Please. Oh, she's got this stop. Yes, please. Request regarding job. Glad to inform me that you'll be indeed be able to meet your request. Please be present in the operating site around 4 p.m. on both days. Please keep a copy of this measure's confirmation receipt as we'll not be able to make changes to the job originally agreed upon. Easy work. Take over the Freedom Plaza shift on April. Whoa, wait a minute. So, so she's taking jobs. Was that the same day? Was that the same day? Oh god, I can't remember. Be located at one of the bombing sites. Yes, thank you. It's only a request, but it connects her to the bombing location. It says, well, two other sites will be on the safe side. Yes, obviously. Um, my number, is, she's got a phone number, and that's a real phone number, otherwise she wouldn't be putting it in the... 
Thank you. All your trash is full of helpful, helpful things. Housekeeper, address, phone number. Okay, that's... Uh, oop, don't want to stop. Uh, private. Apology and offer. Wait, 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 wait. Apology and an offer from uh, Abe. Um, I would like to offer my sincerest apologies. It's not my intent to denounce you in front of all the members of Thought, or worse, basically everyone. After all, so this is about the website. After all, what we do in Sailine persists like a landmine, as I wrote in an early blog post. I should have been more considerate. Your actions at the Circle Mall have turned out to be very different to what I anti complain Okay, that's one I can't pronounce, guys. Sorry. anti complain them to be appreciated them? Well, I think he means expected them to be, but from the structure of that sentence. But that was hardly your fault. It was mine. Instead of passing judgment on you, I would like to offer my help. From my impression, I assume you're somehow someone whose life so far has been troubled, to say the least. Although it may not seem obvious, I have been rather moving background as well. As they put it, it takes one to know one. I would suggest we have a talk about how we might assist each other best. Now please let me know if you're interested. That's not in the trash, that's in the private section. So, sister, what exactly? I don't know. But that does mean that she didn't just toss it away. And uh, here you go. Now I got a nice full... Okay. Do not read. So I guess you just guarded the subject and went straight to reading. The other embarrassing mail. Needless to say, I... Oh, this is a, a relationship. Okay, let's see if I can read a love letter about being too weird. All right. So I guess you disregarded the subject and went straight to reading this utterly embarrassing mail. Nonetheless, I know you would. Uh, I knew you would. Well, don't tell me I didn't warn you. I never. I've never written a text like this in my entire life. So I hope you'll be settlement with me gentle eh, whatever our backpacking trip along the Italian Northwest coast has been okay I will just say amazing brilliant the best one I have ever been on that was not due to the Sun even though it was blazing all ten magnificent 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 days through it was not due to the rocky coastline with its endlessly serpentine roads winding up and down the cliffs and not due to the picturesque villages alongside of them we passed through. It was due to you being there with me that made me enjoy every single second of it. I mean, just remember the one time we wanted to have a photo of us taken? The only person around was that elderly Italian woman. She didn't understand a word of what we wanted and kept shrugging and shaking her head. I had to bite my tongue so hard not to burst out in laughter. But you, Kozyar, just walked over to her, gave her your broadest smile, put the camera into her hand, the finger on the shutter release, then ran back to me to make absolutely sure she didn't take a photo of just me. It's funny how this one of all the shots made for the best photo from the entire trip, don't you think? Every cell in me is just backspace all this letter and not send it. But at the same time, I just want you to read this and know how I feel about you. Seems you have passed the painted Desmond. I can't read that. The name. <laughs> Relationship test. So I may as well write down what I've been trying to say all the time here. I love you. It's a shame, really, because my last name's like horrible. If I can say my last name, I should be able to say anybody's last name. But, yeah. Like her alias, yes. So she isn't single after all. Well, I don't know about that. Because, she. Uh, this is a photo. Can I take the photo? This is a photo of her. All right, whatever. Okay. Uh, Michael? Um, where's the father? I'm beginning to think that he, she is not in a relationship because I'm beginning to think that he is not. You. 
No, we're to marry and have children. It'd be really funny if our name, if my name was Molly. Whoa, wait a second. You're going a bit ahead of me, these things. You know I would like to plan ahead. You do like that. I really like name as a name, though. Don't. Why Molly? Molly, girl, I like your face. Come again? I don't get it. The Beatles? Tell me you don't know. You're the. couple of years they have built a home sweet home with a couple of kids running in the yard of Desmond Molly's what huh uh, she's obviously singing so, it's something about a bra in there wasn't it it's not about a bra so okay so this is them debating getting married having kids For no wonder for a single mother. Everything we found just shows a single mother trying to make ends meet for her son. It seems to be a primary motivation and it's an admirable one at that. One that does not mix well with terrorist ambitions. Yes. I have to prove... Oh? Hello? Is that her? That soldier is worthy of in-depth research, yes. We need to simply know what kind of experience she has. Yes, I figured that out, but first... No. First... Search for while you don't have something sinister in mind. So you know with the stone and salt. So stack associates her with the college one. Too late she tied into we still have to ferry solid case when we can make the three. Uh, okay, well what is popped up here? Do I have access to the military? Thank you. So she is first combat engineer battalion. Ooh. That's a picture that says a thousand words, yeah. So she was first combat, combat engineer, which probably does deal with explosives. She's got a bravery medal here. Six years of service. Okay, enlisted. Seems to have some a long way from being such an honorable person. She still might consider herself honorable, you know, you little twit. It, we are working for a government that seems to be pushing it when it comes to privacy and other issues. Okay, she's listed 2005, assigned platoon, basic combat training, specialist, foreign missions. So she went one of those missions that you could find on the party, um... The party website. <laughs> the party website. Bow, ba -dow, bow, 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 bow. Sounds like a dating website. Uh, Corporal Award of Bravery for saving. Okay. Dishonorable discharge and three months of confinement for being a white. What's by uh, why? A wall. So 2011, she went a wall for some reason. Uh, give me that. Give me that. That's a severe punishment. Do you know this puts her on the same level as any other previously convicted felon? Felon? Hmm. Missions. Well, wait, 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 wait. Uh, first combat battalion. Twenty oh seven. Twenty eleven. Okay, so those are the missions. Ah, and they're going to give me the missions. Safety bill on set of further in time and allow the army and nation to be deployed to homeland whenever needed. Okay, so that's... Okay, peacekeeping mission. There, there, okay. Mine clearance, so... That might... 
explained. Yeah, well, I know. No, I don't think we do. I'm still trying to find things out. Don't push me. No. Patrol. Yeah, that doesn't seem to be a patrol thing. No. Flood aid. So she also is tasked with that. Don't push me, okay? I'm still looking at stuff. Memorial. Why would the memorial be here? She went AWOL 2011, 2011, 2011, 2011, 20... Her boyfriend died. That's what I wanted to find out. Yeah. Yeah. To say it, it definitely provides motivation to hate the government. Let's find out more about the back that backed that up. Well, uh, I'm going to, but I'm not going to listen to that damn whatever it is. I'm going to check something. There's, there's, there's stuff all the place? What do you mean? Somebody else die? No, there ain't. It's all... It's all covered. Why is it still red? That would have been... Yeah, I'm assuming it must have been like... <sighs> she... Did she end up like getting wounded while trying to save her own boy, uh, her own boyfriend? Where's the government's? I want more from the government. Government. Aha! Projects. So what's 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 this have to do? To inform employers whenever an applicant or employer of, is an ex-convict, and you just said this would made her equivalent of a com convict. She couldn't get a job. Horrible for her. Especially given that she is on her own taking care of her son. Takes one hell of a motivation gear with the fact that he was killed on a mission sent by the government. Yes, now... Oh, I'm probably sure the only thing important is that... But with that new insight... Cannot know that she might be out for revenge. Yes, yes, yes. Excuse me, guys, just drinking something. You lied. Her son, she's been, oh, sorry, so her son's been baby, babysat. Come here. We're going to know where she's at in about an hour. Hmm? Circle Hall. Circle Mall. So we just connected to the Circle Mall. And even at the right time. Yes. That means... Whoa, her best pick there's no oh, good uh, things are not looking good for her. Okay, I just will you stop that? Uh, suggest that she's strong reasons for hating, she knows how to build bombs, yes, yes. Five we can associate with every single bombing. Seems our our fine prime subject is ground for arrest. Well done. I need a moment to talk to my superiors, I'll get back to you soon, keep observing. Well, if you'd let me Get around! Oh God! Hmm. Oh God! Oh God! No! Nope. <laughs> 
Oh, please. My name is Scrooge. Why do all these ghosts of Christmas past still you come to haunt me? Ah, ha, 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 ha. Technology for... Or ask me about my problems. All right, what is it? Oh, she found me in her computer. My PC switched on this morning. I just tried to look something up online, so I went all haywire. No! No, she found me in her computer! Pop popped up like a million warnings of some outside intrusions. I pulled the plug. I was like, you already fixed the problem then. Yeah, you're, you're really helpful, Mr. Hancock. Every single guy earlier, I think he was some kind of hacker. He said... He had sent him away, and now he's hacking. He said you had sent him, and now he's hacking my goddamn PC. This guy's a nuisance. You broke into my bank account as well. Oh, they're blaming him for everything I've done. Ha 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 Sorry, that was uncalled for. I contact by this guy as well. He was babbling about everything that we had done in the past. Claimed he... Give our stuff away to the cops, blah, 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 the usual stuff. He told you that as well? What did you do? I told him to, oh, what do you take me for? You think he really has something? I need to be sure doesn't have a thing. Even if the guy had something, have you gotten your hands dirty lately? What's what's the fuzz about? Oh, get out of here before the cops. Whoa, whoa, uh. I need to give that information quickly. Uh. Need to get away before the cops are here. What? Get away? She what? We cannot let our main subject escape. I will assemble an intervention team immediately. We will start trading roadblocks. The information intervention team, they should move in aggressively as you found out she might react violently. Uh, since her device offline, we have to start at her home. Thankfully, sure, I know. We're in her dress. Uh, go through her communications. Maybe she hit at places she knows where she isn't at home yet. Uh, blah, 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 whatever. For it. Anything important to me at once, I brief the intervention team accordingly. Uh, it's in your hands now. Good luck and stay valiant. Uh, what? 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 Oh, good. Just called Julian. I think you're working right now. Why did she hang up on Harrison? I should have read the rest of that coming here. I'm watching up at work. Is anything okay? Coming for me. He's been stalking me for days. What? Will you help me? Of course, but how? Do you know somewhere safe that me and my son can lay low for a while? Mm, I don't know. Well, at least your son's not with her. Otherwise, she'd kill everybody who showed up. You got some think of something, please. Okay, okay. I think I know a place. It's in the middle of nowhere. It's home of No, wait, can't say it. I think he might be listening. How? This guy is a hacker. He's already gone through my computer and I'm pretty sure he's listening to my calls. Are you kidding me? You mean like maybe listening right now? Just don't say anything that will give my location away, okay? Better safe than sorry. Just help me get out of here. Jesus, you know, but a bit late for that now. Now he knows where I work. Sorry, I've already known where you work, dear. Uh, thank you. Give me a sec. Just pack some stuff. And then the cops show up. I'm bringing my gun. No! No! No, don't do that! No! No! Whoa, 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 are you looking to get yourself killed? If somebody is listening to this, they know we're armed. If I don't bring it, she's got the gun. Could be dead anyway. So she's got a gun. Julia tried to cut her out of it, but she got the gun. At the door. I'm going to go out the back door. Back door, she likes climb it. It's also injured me to just climb out the window. Oh, damn. Ninja. Please don't shoot her. And don't shoot my guys. Oh, no, no, no. He spotted me. Oh, no. This gun down. He knew I was climbing out of the window. How? 
Uh, okay. Well, I told them they're climbing out the back door. Uh, back door, back window. Oh. Doing. Uh, not going down without it. Oh, no, 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 Please, no. They should have tried to grab her when she was going after a kid. Oh. Scene. What the? Need my connection back now. Well, I can't do anything about it. Finally. Looks like we're successful. However, our target. She didn't make it. Oh. There's a shootout after the first shots. The team tried to fire. I told him to go in aggressively. I thought it was the right thing to do. This to happen. Well, she had a gun. <sighs> Power and lead. Yeah, thank you very much, achievement. Who is writing at the worst possible time? I just want to be done with this horrible. T Can you check the mail, please? Uh, mail? Uh. Nina, I'm truly sorry for having drawn the investigator's attention to you, but frankly, how does he know I'm an investigator? Hello? But frankly, you overstepped the boundaries of our agreement. The bombs were meant as warning to those who are indifferent. A beacon of remembrance to our message that the thoughts must always be free. They're not meant to kill. Once again, you disappoint me with your instrumental hate and rage. Wait a minute. Okay. Oh my god. Yeah. Can't believe you just found this, can you? They worked together on this mess, but why? I still don't get it. Neither do I, because that sounds completely indifferent to what he said before. Uh, this changes everything. We must find Abraham. Goes with today, tomorrow. Excuse me. Before we need some rest, it's been a one hell of a day. You may log out now. <sighs> don't really want to log out. Believe that after all you haven't seen? I don't think... Oh, he's confusing me. Definitely, this one's confusing me. This one doesn't confuse me. He's a Janus, two-faced god. He presents multiple faces. He wants to be light. He wants to be in control. He wants to be right. He wants to be right. And therefore... Whoever wins, he wants to be on the right side. She... I think she's sincere. She's a rich, spoiled brat. She was sincere, but she went too far. I don't know about this guy. I think he's just a hacker. Uh, the others, I can't investigate. Okay, well, let's end the day. Yes, log out. Learn the following. Unperson. What the heck do you mean unperson? That's a term from 1984 in which uh, somebody has decided they've disgraced the party or they've been vaporized and, and then from then on you do not treat that person as if he ever existed or she ever existed. They were never born, they never had education, they never had family, they never knew you, they never, they never left the desk messy, they never forgot to flush, they never existed at all. Okay, so we saved them all, thought Nina needed to be investigated, she was killed when she offered resistance to the invention team trying to arrest her. Intervention team, what a nice turn of phrase that is. Uh, deceased boyfriend? You mean he died while in duty? Oh. Were they in the same unit? I still don't... I, I'm, I, I'm still getting loose ends in that position, and she's dead. 
Initiate has contact with two targets, so investigation has been authorized. Plan to hack the party website, which was averted. Motivated, he didn't intend to buy and to kill people. Yeah, he motivated her to do the bombings. There's bombs involved. People are going to die. I don't see how he could prevent that. She had any trouble at the start of 2017. She has trouble with relationship with her parents, which really doesn't have that. He's condoned the... Condemned, condoned, condemned the bombings and said he had only predicted bombings to take his, make his point clear. Okay. Well, what happened last time is I accidentally did this. When I probably should be doing this. Do she want to end the session? Yes. So here we go to the main menu of the game. And where this, at this point, I will be saying... So long, farewell, Vita saying goodbye. <laughs> no, I'm joking. Well, no, I just saying that. So I'm not joking, obviously. So this is the end of chapter three. Ow! My hearing, my hearing. And so this is Callisto eighty four thirteen playing Smith, playing Orwell. Saying goodbye. Ironically, I'm gonna go re read a uh, play based on nineteen eighty four. I started it a few days ago and the problem is, I since I know the story so well, the play kind of comes across as kind of meh. I sometimes feel that adaptions lose the whole point. They try to follow the book so much that they actually lose the point of the book. But I'm sure you guys have all noticed that happens sometimes to movies and adaptions of films and all that, or, or books or books to films. Yeah. So I'll see you guys. Bye-bye.